Hi guys, this is Oliver, and today we are going to review Smile. I, I watched it yesterday at the movie theaters, and uh, this is my movie review of the movie. And uh, I didn't think this movie was that scary. Many people are talking about this movie and how scary it is. OMG, so scary. I didn't think it was that scary because if the trailers spoiled too much in my opinion uh, I think the trailer spoiled a little bit too much and the trailers showed the, the scariest scenes of the movie so when the the scenes happened in the movie um, it, it, I saw it coming and it wasn't that scary well I didn't watch all, all, all of the trailers I only watched the first trailer but even that spoiled a little bit too much so it was a bit disappointing coming to the scary part uh, on the scary side because I didn't think it was that scary. But uh, I, I will say, that I, won't, I don't want to spoil anything for anyone who hasn't seen the movie, but uh, the, the last 30 minutes of the movie or the last 10 minutes or something like that are really, really, really scary. They are fucking scary. Uh, because uh, first of all, it wasn't spoiled in the trailer, or maybe it was, uh, but... Uh, it wasn't spoiled in the first trailer because I haven't seen uh, Smile trailer two and trailer three, but so maybe uh, it was spoiled in the trailer. But I didn't watch those trailers at least. But like the first uh, and second, uh, it, it was just really creepy, really scary, a really good jump scare at the end. Uh, yeah, fucking scary. It it, it, it gives me the chills. It was so scary. The the last thirty minutes or, or the last ten minutes, I think, was the only thing that was scary. It was said uh, the movie wasn't that scary, uh, because the trailer gave me gave away too much. But uh, the, the, for the last ten minutes of the movie were fucking scary. It it, it really was. It, it was really really scary. And uh, that was probably the only thing that was scary that frightened me for the movie, because it it was like, ah yikes. It was really scary. It really was. That the, the, that ending scene was so scary. But uh, I think the rest of the movie before that wasn't that scary, but I think the last 10 minutes was so scary. And also, I don't want to spoil too much, but there was like a, like a monster at the end of the movie. It looked really good CGI. It was really scary. It really was. It was so scary. If this movie is directed by Porker Finn, and if this is the first movie he has ever directed, so props to him. Like that, it looked really good CGI. It look, and visually, it looked very scary. It looked fucking scary. So, uh, props to him. I don't know if it looked as scary as uh, Hulk King in She-Hulk, but uh, let me know in the comments below which monster you thought look, looked scarier. But I think people are freaking out too much about this movie. I think I, th I think someone got a heart attack from this movie because of how scary it was. Like, I chill out. It wasn't that scary. Or maybe it's, it's because the trailer gave away too much and everyone was talking about how scary it was. Maybe that's why I didn't think it, I didn't find that scary, but at least the last ten minutes were scary. The last ten minutes in the movie were really scary, but then the rest of the movie wasn't that scary. It, it was creepy at times, and at times it was pretty scary, but it wasn't that scary because the the trailers gave away too much. But as a movie, uh, my movie review, the actual movie, and if we, if we ignore the scariness, I think it was a pretty good movie. So like I said, the trailers gave away too much. A bit too much, but uh, I still think it was a pretty good movie. I liked the main character, and uh, she was a really good actress. Yeah, I liked this movie. It was pretty good. It was well made. I liked the scene with the head. I wish that scene wasn't in, in the trailer, because that scene could have been much scarier if it wasn't in the trailer. Because I, I really wanted to see that scene play out without knowing it. Knowing it. Because that scene could have been way better and way scarier if it wasn't in, in the trailer. But it was still a pretty cool scene, a pretty well-made scene with the head falling down. It was pretty cool. It was some, some really good practical effects. In my movie reviews of 2022, most of those movies, it's like, uh, for the cinematography, it's been so good in, in like every movie coming out in 2022. Except for Jeepers Creepers Reborn, by the way. But besides that, it's like, have, had, have some, some great cinematography. And the same thing can be said about Smile. Uh, visually, this movie looks really good. Not as well shot as some of the other movies of 2022, like the Batman, but it's, it's still very well shot, and it looks pretty cool. Now for me, in the end, Smile was a pretty good movie, I think. 
it wasn't that scary. It could have been better if the trailer didn't give give away too much. And you you may, you you may be saying to yourself, Oliver, you watched too many movie trailers. Well, it must it was my fault. And also, I skipped the last two trailers, so I, I'm happy I did that because the, the last ten minutes of the movie were really scary. I'm happy I skipped those those parts. Even even the first trailer spoiled a little bit too much. So if, if the trailers kind of ruined this movie. Because if the scariest scenes in this movie were kind of ruined by the trailers, except for the last 10 minutes. I think the movie wasn't that scary, except for the last 10 minutes. It, was, it gave me some chills. It was perfect for Halloween. Sadly, I had to wait an entire movie to for the actual last 10 minutes for something scary to happen. But still, it was it was pretty scary. It was, uh, yeah, it was fucking creepy. Jesus Christ. I'm, I'm still thinking about it. I still have it. I can't unsee it. Ah. But but I still I don't want to spoil too much. But I kind of like how how the movie ended the same way that it started. Kind of. Well, I, I don't want to give away too much. But yeah, when the movie ended and and the, the credits started started rolling, if the song Lalipa Lalipa, if that song was playing in the background, I love that. That was perfect. That was perfect in credits. That was perfect. Especially after that scary stuff happening in the last ten minutes, you get you just uh, that that song just plays. That was really funny. That was awesome. I really liked that. So yeah, so it was a pretty good movie. And then after, when we when we walked when we were going to walk into the movie theater, an awesome Black Adam statue was outside uh, of the theater. That was awesome. And I took some awesome pictures. And yeah, I had a really good experience watching Smile at the movie theaters. There were a lot of jump scares in this movie, which was awesome. The the jump scares in this movie were really good. I think. And uh, every time there was a jump scare, for the crowd w w w w was screaming a lot, and it was like it was it was, it was awesome. <sighs> and some really good acting from the main character, the the main girl. I don't wanna. I remember. I don't remember what her name was, but I, she was a great actor, and she was pretty. She was kind of pretty. That's it for my movie review for Smile, and I really hope you enjoy this video. I'll see you guys next time. Boo!